All right, everybody, we're back with YouTube's favorite show, The Wine Opener. And today, we are gonna open up a electronic wine opener. It just says electric wine opener, that's how you know that it's an electric wine opener. All right, so let me, let's unbox this thing real quick, let you know what you're getting. You're getting some documentation with a piece of paper telling you how to put in batteries, which is valuable, let's just say. Some more documentation with, again, other languages about how to put in batteries. It's awesome. I have pre-installed the battery, so we don't have to waste time with that in the video. Um, we've got six months warranty. That's great. Um, and some other stuff. Let's go ahead and get, let's get the star of the show out, you know? So here we go. We've got our wine opener with two buttons on it, and that's where the batteries go. It's really important. The batteries go in there. So we got our wine opener. We're going to open some wine today. All right, I'm going to put that down for a second to show you the other stuff that comes in it. This is one of those things that helps you open the wine, like put it on the top and spin it around. Uh, this is something that you add also to the top of your wine. It's a wine stopper, but it also kind of like uh, gets some, some oxygen in there and helps like the flow of the wine coming out. And finally, you've got your good old-fashioned wine stoppers. Let's open these so it doesn't look like plastic all over them. All right, this is just a good old-fashioned wine wine opener, but it also has this little thing on the top. And guys, I'm not a big wine drinker, so I don't know what the hell this does. Oh yeah, I know what it is, okay. So this is to like pump out the, the air that's in your wine to keep it fresh, okay. All right, I drank a little bit of wine in my day, not a lot, but a little bit. Okay, here is the thing that's gonna add the oxygen. Don't break it. It's gonna add the oxygen to your wine. And here you go, little thing right there, exciting. Just pop it in. Has a little hole in the bottom, like so, and it adds oxygen to the wine. And then we've got our opener thing as well. So this is really important. This helps, so you, what you do with this, you clamp it on the top, clamp it on, and then you turn it around the top of your wine, like so. Put it on the top of your wine, and you're good. I already opened the top of it, so this isn't necessary. Okay, now, the star of the show. Let's do it. Let's open some wine. The wine. Okay. Here we go. Wine opener. Buttons. Show you how it works right real quick. Doesn't make a lot of noise, but it's got a powerful motor in there. Four AA batteries. I am putting it on top of my wine, and we're corking it down. Okay. We're going in, guys. We are going in. I should probably time lapse this because it's slow and also somewhat. Ad okay, so now we've got the grip. Look, the, the top is coming off. Cork's coming out. I'm turning it only because I think the batteries I put in were a little bit weak. They weren't fresh batteries, so the, the, the motor might not be as strong as it could be. And. After a little bit of wiggling, what do we got? We have some wine. Yeah. There we go. Then to get this out, I'm going to try to backtrack the, uh, the thing. And it's coming. This is literally the speed in which this works. <laughs> okay, and my batteries have died. So my cork is in there. And that may be where it stays forever. So use fresh batteries, guys. It will probably do a little bit better than this. Really awesome, uh, really awesome how-to video there, Mike. All right, so to, to use this part, this is the pump, you know. Get that air out. And now I have fresh wine forever. It's good. It works. Okay, guys, um, let me talk about this for a second. Let's talk about our wine opener. Do I like it? Yeah. yeah, I like it. For ten bucks, are you gonna go? Can you go wrong for ten bucks here? I don't know. Probably not. Um, seems to work okay. Seems to be working good. Um, it was pretty easy to install. My old batteries, I literally pulled them out of like a Roku remote, and then like some somewhere else they were just laying around. So definitely old batteries. That's why I got stuck. This is probably not what's gonna happen for you. You'll probably have much better use for this if you just get new batteries. Um, Here's our wine pour thing. We haven't tried that. Assuming it works, you just put it in the same way. And you're good. You got your wine. Um, you're open. I think for 10 bucks, guys. For 10 bucks. It's 10 bucks. What, what are you going to do? What else are you going to do with 10 bucks? Get like, get like two burgers or something? I mean, who cares? Just buy it. Right? I like this. 
if I was, if I really drank a lot of wine, and I don't, but if I did, I would use something like this because it's electric. I don't want to hurt myself doing it. So I'm going to tell you, um, from, from my perspective, this is a pretty decent buy. You get some other little trinket that comes, comes along with it. That's good for you. Um, helps out. You, uh, it does the job. It's electric. Ten bucks. I'm in. All right. Guys, let me know what you think. Um, is this something that you would buy? Do you even give a crap about this? If so, awesome. Give me a thumbs up. If not, you think it's horrible, thumbs down, whatever. Um, like the, the video, subscribe to the channel. That helps me out a lot. Um, for everybody watching on Amazon as well, I'm telling you, like, I think it's a good buy. I would buy it again. Um, I appreciate it. I think I'm going to buy a couple more of these just as gifts to hand out for, like, the, uh, you know, the white elephant type gift parties at the end of the year, stuff like that. Maybe Mother's Day presents, stuff like that. These are like nice little under, I mean, under 10 bucks. You get a nice like professional looking package, nothing too fancy about it. And you get your stuff. So yeah, I like it guys. I, I think it's a good buy. I would buy it again and do yourself a favor and get one of these because two thumbs up for me, both hand, but two thumbs up. All right. Thank you very much guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.